Hi, Kelly Baker here. I'm in Milford, Nebraska today visiting Southeast Community College, and I'm joined with Bill and Glenn from the John Deere Ag Tech program. Welcome, Kelly. Awesome. We're ready to check the school out. Let's check it out. Bill, do you want to tell us about the program? Well, the John Deere Tech program was started in Milford, Nebraska. We are the first of the John Deere Tech programs. Um, our program is very unique in that we only have one hour of general studies class. We are an eight to four program preparing our students for the workforce. We work very, very closely with the dealers, with John Deere, um, we've had the training center managers here and we've done even as far as having training center managers here for a graduation and basically did a handoff. It's going from the community college setting to a John Deere facility um, and, and creating that future. Um, we do have six instructors in the program which you know is pretty unique around um, and so there's a lot of one-on-one. -on -one. We do have a maximum of 20 students that we take four times a year into the program. Our students graduate with an Associate of Applied Science degree as well as 68 John Deere credits and four certifications which qualifies them for a lot of the John Deere classes. Mm -hmm. Our facility was uh, designed to replicate what a John Deere training center would be like. Um, tutors are free. Um, we have a lot of support services here at the college to ensure that our students are successful. And, and again, it's just part of what we feel is needs to be part of that experience. Hi, I'm here with Haley, and she's the admissions technician here at Southeast Community College. Do you want to tell us about your role um, with a student? Yeah, yeah. So uh, like you said, I'm the admissions technician on campus. So one of my main roles is to actually process the applications that we receive. Um, so that's that's one part of it. But I'm also the contact person that can, can help you plan tours, can help you just get more information about the program itself, get you connected with instructors, that kind of stuff. Can you tell us about the John Deere Ag Tech program here? Yeah, John Deere Ag Tech. Um, the students are so involved um, on campus, but also in their program. Um, and you've never really seen students more committed to a program because they have that sponsor sponsorship, which really makes it a lot more serious for them because they're, they're doing it for a job that they currently have. Um, and so the students get really involved on campus, like I said, um, and they're just so passionate about what they do. And you can see that passion reflected in our instructors and our students. Very good. And so what's campus life like here? Yeah, yeah. So we Milford is a small community. community. It's about 2,500 people. Um, and so that actually reflects in our campus as well. So we have a smaller campus, um, but that just means that we get more individualized attention for our students. Um, that allows them to, to not only succeed in their, in their education, but as well as their, their professional careers. Our classrooms are set up with interactive projectors and the highest, the best of the best that we can get in the way of technologies into there with smart boards and, and the technologies that way. When we built the facility that we're in, um, we started out with a 80 by 250 foot facility. We added 50 feet on more as we have the construction program. And then um, three years ago, we added another 80 by 300 addition onto there. And in that project, then we did um, put LED lighting into there. We put in geothermal, so our shop and our classrooms are all heated and cooled. So we've got air conditioning in the shop, in the classrooms as well as the heat. One of the neat things we also do is, um, while they're a student in the program, we actually take them on factory tours. So we're gonna take them over to Moline, Illinois. We're gonna take them, actually we take off and we head over to Ankeny, Iowa and we watch them build sprayers and, and cotton pickers and then to Waterloo and they see the engine works and see engines being built and, and tractors being built and go to the museum and then we take them to Moline and we go through 
harvester works, see them build combines and planters at the planter works and take them to the world headquarters and take them to the parts distribution center. Um, and so we just want that whole well-rounded experience for our students. Um, we have 12 acres on the west end of our campus and so the students go out there in their last quarter they're with us and they actually go out there and they map it and then they run auto steer, they run uh, uh, iTech Pro, all of the high-end systems into there and there's not a better way for a student to understand something than to actually experience it and with that system into there they're able to go out there and actually operate that equipment and so we have five tractors here that are on um, loan from John Deere on an ongoing basis. Um, all of them are set up with all of the latest and greatest technologies that are on there. Um, we have a combine um, in our facility that, that we utilize for that training. Um, we've got sprayers, we've got planters, um, all of the different components that are needed to, again, prepare those students for um, employment at the dealership. We see you know, companies like American Implement needing more and more um, really qualified technicians. Um, and we are developing high level diagnostic technicians. We're not looking to develop somebody that's just gonna wash parts or do those kind of things. All right, now I'm here at an apartment on campus at SCC, and I'm joined with Lydia. Hi. Hi. Do you want to tell us about the housing options? Yeah, at SCC, there's a few different options. There's the typical, there's the classic two-person dorm room, which is in Cornhusker. And they also have some other options, which is one person, or three people, or it's even four in the regular dorm rooms. And what's really cool is SCC also offers apartment staff with them. Very good. And yeah. what about the activities that are offered on campus? Oh yeah, there's some cool activities that the dorm offers, which is um, every Wednesday they've got a different kind of activity. It ranges from in the summertime to pool parties to slip and slides, um, as well as like volleyball tournaments or even kickball. And what is a, a typical student like here at SEC? There's not particularly a typical student that comes to SEC because there's a lot of different kinds of people that come to SEC, from city backgrounds to country backgrounds, which is really cool. Well, thanks for letting us yeah, check out your apartment. No problem. Well, we are, out of all the John Deere Tech programs in the United States and Canada, we have the highest retention rate of our graduates that are still working in the John Deere dealerships. So it's just pretty amazing to see that. So, And you think it's just because you guys prepare them in such a way here that just carries over into the workforce? I think that, you know, the, that flawless transition that we create makes it much, much easier. It's a fluid transition from what they do here to the dealership. Um, so it's just, you know, that type of exposure that you get and expectations. Absolutely. And something you shared earlier um, is about the lifetime placement, career placement. Yes. Um, so Southeast Community College offers lifetime placement. Um, so no matter if you graduated last week, last month, last year, or 40 years, um, our placement department does that for free. Wonderful. Well, thanks for having us. All right. Thank you.